Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another um, penny savings challenge video. So if you're new here, welcome. My name's Alicia and on this channel we do all things budgeting, cash stuffing, sinking funds, we do um, saving challenges, um, just all of the things related to money, personal finance, all of that. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, then definitely keep watching. So today we're going to be doing our penny savings challenge. Um, so what we do is we just try to check off these numbers each week. This is um, the 365 day penny savings challenge is actually meant to do you check off one of these numbers every single day for the whole year and then at the end of the year you have six hundred and sixty seven dollars and ninety five cents. Um, so that is really difficult to do when you're filming. So for me I just try to do it once a week and I try to check off seven numbers. Um, some weeks it works out great and some weeks I don't check off seven numbers. So um, you can see I've got a little note up here at the top. It says nine extra. I need to check off nine extra plus the seven from this week. So we probably won't get all of those checked off. Um, but as I have money left from my like spending money for the week, I'm adding that in. So today we've got like $4 extra here. Um, so hopefully that will help us to catch back up. So I know I could probably go through and catch it all up at once and just put like $20 in, um, but I'm just trying to make it work with just change right now. So I am adding a little bit in as I have it. So um, we'll go ahead and get started. So we're going to go ahead and dump out our change here. And I used to have a lot more change than what I seem to have now. I think we just used to go out a little bit more. Um, so we're not going out quite as much and we're just not spending quite as much. So we don't have as much change as we used to, but um, we're still gonna try to make this work. So we're gonna go through, um, I try to start with like our smallest number. So our smallest number we have here is gonna be $1.94. So we'll do that. So we've got 25, 50, 75, $1. 25, 50, 75, 85, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94. All right, so that takes care of this one. The next number is gonna be $1.95. So we have 25, 50, 75, $1, 25, 50, 75, 85, and 95. So that is two numbers so far. Next up is gonna be $1.96. So we've got 25, whoops, 50, 75, $1. 25, 50, 75, $1. 85, 95, and 96. So that is three numbers. And then next up is going to be $1.97. So we have, let's see here, 25, 50, um, 75, $1. Whoops. Move those over just a little bit. All right, so $1, 25, 50. Um, 60, 70, 80, 90, 95, 96, 97. All right, so that takes care of one, two, three, four so far. Um, let's see. The next one is $1.98. I don't know if I'm going to have enough for that, so let's see what we can do. Let's see 10, 20, 30. 40, 50, 60, um, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, one dollar, oh, there's a quarter, 25, 30, 35, 40, there's a dime, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, um, 71, 72, 73, 74, 75, 76, 77, 78, 79, 80, 81, 82, 
92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98. Okay, here we go. All right, so that took care of one, two, three, four, five so far, and we've got some pennies left over here. Not a lot, just a few pennies. And I'm gonna flip over to our second page and see what I can check off with these $1 bills. All right, so I know I've got several $2 amounts. Um, so like all of these are $2 amounts. So we are gonna check off, let's see, $2 and $2. So we can check off um, two $2 amounts today. So that takes care of one, two. So that takes care of our seven for today. And we do still need to, um, we still have those nine extra that we need to check off. So hopefully we'll get some of those next week. If all else fails, eventually I will end up just put throwing like a 20 in there to catch it back up. But um, right now I feel like we're doing fine with it. All right, and then let's see what we've got left over here. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 10, 11. So what we'll do is we'll take one of these $3 amounts and check it off and then we will mark it down to $2.89 because we had 11 cents there. Um, so what I do whenever I have just a little bit of change left is I try to mark off some of these larger numbers so when I have to add the money later on, I don't have quite as much to add. So if I can get rid of all the $3 amounts, that'll be awesome and then I'll start working on those $2 amounts and I'll probably mark those down to like 275. So, I mean, it's a whole lot easier to add 275 than, you know, $3.65 or whatever the larger numbers are. So, um, that's just kind of how I do it. That's what works for me. If it works for you to do it and check off one number every day, then definitely do it that way. The important thing is that we are saving. Um, so yeah, that is all I have for you guys today. Thank you so much for tuning in for another video. And if you're new here and you enjoy the content and you haven't subscribed yet, please consider hitting the subscribe button and helping me grow my channel. I will see you guys back here next time. Bye.